the corner of Fifth Avenue and 22nd Street. I stood and waited for a girl I knew at the spot where we agreed to meet. It was four minutes of two. At four of two, I stood waiting for the girl. I was four minutes early for the date we had planned. I was planning to say I was in love with her just as soon as she showed for a two o'clock date. And the clock said four of two. At four of two, I was staring into space. She was not yet late. According to the clock, I was feeling nervous, so I kept looking up at the clock sticking out of the side of the building, and it still said four of two. At four of two, I began to feel tired. I rubbed my eyes, and again I checked the time. It seemed as if the sky was growing dark. But I felt reassured when I looked at the clock and it still said four of two. I laid my head down on the sidewalk so in case she were coming I would have a better view. But no one was there so I stretched out and closed my eyes for a second or two. It was four minutes of two. And once I awoke to a futuristic world, there were flying cars and gigantic metal bugs. I grown a beard, it was long and white, but I knew that the girl would be coming very soon. For though everything had changed, there were still